Hi, I'm Gladys, and today we're going to assemble the Eclipse 4-in-1 crib. Make sure you have all the proper pieces and hardware, and if anything is missing, please call Consumer Care. One way to know you're working with the correct hardware is to compare it with the illustrations that come in the instructions. Like that. The first step is to attach the legs to the crib ends, and for this you will need six 40mm bolts, four 45mm bolts, two metal pins, and the provided Allen wrench. Remember to always use the labels as guidance. Remember to use the short side of the Allen wrench to tighten the bolt. The second step is to attach the back rail and back rail top to the crib ends. And for this you will need six 55mm bolts and the provided Allen wrench. Remember to always use the labels as guidance. Remember to use the shirt side of the outer wrench to tighten the bolt. Make sure the tenon goes inside the slot. Like that. That's it. The third step is to attach the mattress support. And for this, you will need four 18 millimeter bolts and the provided Allen wrench. Remember to use the highest position for your newborn and then go downwards as your child grows. Use the shirt set of the Allen wrench to tighten the bolt. And that's it. The final step is to attach the front rail. And for this, you will need eight 55 millimeter bolts and the provided Allen wrench.
Remember to use the shirt side of the Allen wrench to tighten the bolt. And that's it. Remember to store the instructions back in the pouch they came in. You're going to need them later. Congratulations, you've just assembled the Eclipse 4-in-1 crib. Now we're going to convert your crib into a day bed. Remember those instructions you put away? You're going to need them. The mattress support should be on its lowest position since your child is now bigger. The first step in the conversion is to remove the front rail and for this you will need the provided Allen wrench. That's it. The second step is to attach the stabilizer bar. And for this, you will need two 80 millimeter bolts, two barrel nuts, and two metal pins. And of course, the provided Allen wrench. Remember to insert the barrel nut sideways so the bolt can go through. Remember to use the short side of the Allen wrench to tighten the bolt. And that's it. Congratulations, now you have a day bed. Toddler guardrails are available for purchase.